Okay, hello everyone. Uh, I am taking a little video of a satellite uh, radio communication system that is going on eBay uh, either today or tomorrow. And I just wanted to give you a, a little rundown of what the whole package includes. So uh, the star of the show here is this Motorola LST5C. It's a fairly recent system. I don't know precisely when, but certainly uh, from 2000 uh, in change, 2000s. Um, it's a really great system. Uh, I've used it personally. Works really cool. It's, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, here's a, an angle of it uh, uh, on that side. It's got some uh, great handles. And on the back, you can attach one of two things. You can either attach this is the LST100. This is an AC power supply. Uh, you can see the connector here. Unfortunately, I do not have a cable for this, but I believe you'll be able to figure this out no problem. Uh, and here is a battery box. And the battery box is used with a standard um, type of a battery that here the battery is not included. These are impossible to ship now uh, through the mail system. But this is a 2590. It could be a 390, a 590, 5590, you name it. Uh, in addition, the system comes with a nice satellite antenna. Uh, this is a, let's see if we can get nice up close here. Uh, this is a Trivec Avant model 2040-2A. Uh, this is really cool, and I'm going to see if I can edit this video and, and show how uh, you put one of these things up. It's very cool. Uh, along with it, you've got these three legs just to hold the antenna up and these director elements which give it some directivity uh, and I'll explain more about that in the video I make specifically for that. Finally we've got uh, uh, an H189 handset uh, very nice in fact uh, these really work a lot better than the 250s in my opinion the sound is just much better we don't need that noise cancellation feature of the 250 because we are not in combat situation and we've got a uh, a little uh, BNC extension that's used here. Now, if you notice, it's kind of an unusual setup. Um, I don't know why they do this, but most of these satellite antennas work the same way. There is a cable coming out of the antenna with a male. Usually what you'd expect is a mounted female on this and use the male um, a patch cable, but that's not how it works. Uh, and then uh, the only last bit of all this is is this uh, nice little carrying case for the antenna. Uh, it's a little uh, it's a little bit beat up, but still has all its pieces, a little bit of a rip in it somewhere in here too. Um, but it holds the, the, the whole satellite uh, antenna, and it's, it's really, really good. So uh, this is the system. It's going to go up on eBay, and um, I will do try to do a separate video on how to assemble the SATCOM antenna. Thanks. So uh, what we're going to do here is show you how to assemble one of these uh, these at, uh, uh, Trivec Avant satellite antennas. Um, and so what we have here is we've got three stands, and this is a set of director elements. Often there are two sets of director elements. Uh, we only have one set here, but for receive-only applications, one set's actually better because it has a, a wider... Uh, a view of the sky with only one director element and therefore it's easier to, to locate the satellite with two director elements you get more forward power but it's more pinpointed so it's harder to find uh, find the satellite so let's get started what we do is we put one of these legs and by the way you can see that there's some paint loss on these but nothing a little spray can can't fix so first thing we do is put these in here these Sometimes these can be a little loose and they have to hold them. Okay, that's the first step. Uh, next step, what I like to do is to tilt over. So you use uh, this knurled nut and tilt it over and you get a nice tightening. Next, you start opening up uh, the reflector element. So this is kind of neat. It's, um, Pull this ring down, and uh, out come the. This is actually the driven element. 
Uh, then what you do is you fold down. This is the reflector. You fold this down and then you expand the full length, all of these little. Okay, so the idea here is that this is the driven element. This is connected to the radio. This is a reflector. And then we put in, yeah, and we put in the, uh, the director element. So let's, let's show you how this opens. This also is spring-loaded. We open up the outside first. There are four elements, I'm sorry, yeah, four elements in each section. And then there are three sections. Okay, and finally, uh, this goes into the antenna itself. You'll see that there is, you get up close, there's like a notch here. And there's a wire, there's like a, a, a wire that goes into this notch to help it really uh, snap in good. So what you do is just sort of rotate it um, until, yeah, there it is. It gets, catches. Yeah, you can feel it catches. And so uh, that's basically it. That's how you set it up. Uh, the final thing to do, of course, would be to connect this extension, the BNC extension, from the antenna uh, to your transceiver. Well, that's it. Thank you.